Ooh, ooh. Oh, wait a second. I'm already interested. Look, it is the kid who sent the parts packing. The kid who rebuilt the whole village, including this humble establishment. When we met at the stable, I took you for the fragile type. Glad you proved me wrong. Ooh. Enough sappy sp stuff. This is the lucky treasure shop where I run what you call a game of luck. See the treasure chest? Pick any one of them and open it. Don't be sure I crack one open. Okay. So this isn't for money in this game. It's for items. It is money. Come here, kid. Let's see it. Red. So that means you get the prize on the right. Ooh. Must be pretty happy scoring that prize for free. If you like, I'd deliver it to your place of residence. Too bad I don't do that. Oop. Also, I'll take that rupee back. It's not for you to keep. Okay. Someone catch. I have to cap how much you play or I'd go bankrupt. Wouldn't want to shut me down right after you put me back in business, would you? Didn't think so. Come back after you want to later if you want another round. Uh, I don't want either of the other parts, but let's see. Ah. Well, you're not going to change the answer, though. I guess you want to play that badly. No, never mind. Just come back later. Huh? Oh. I know that smell anywhere. That's the smell I dream about, sure enough. You've got a roasted par or organ in that pouch, don't you? Give it. <laughs> Thanks, kid. I have a real weakness for roasted porgy. Tell you what, seeing as you were so generous, I'll bend the rules and let you play again. But it doesn't get... Oh, so I see. That's fine, too. Five. So it's blue. Ooh. But if there's multiple things I wanted, I could get multiple. Yeah, it's not too ah. bad. I hate to see it go. You must be pretty happy someone... Yep. <sighs> Not for you to keep. <laughs> if you want another cracker, you have to come back later. That's fine. Uh, I'd rather. I, I don't need. I don't need that. I have so many of those. Good to know how that works, though. I could stay the night for free. See you, traveler. Good to see it again. It's it's me. Remember, I met at the car car bazaar. <laughs> You're a horrible though if you get a if you freaking forget a fabulous woman like me. But your saving grace is that you've done so much good around here. You beat those awful pirates, and you rebuilt my inn, without which I'd have no way to make a living. <laughs> and indeed, the whole village benefits from the customers I draw here. Sarks Sars Sars Sarsko, from the bottom of my heart. Now, special salt spa will soothe your body and soul. Oh. Uh, let's do the salt spa. Ah. Bring their own salt. Okay. Five pieces of rock salt. Here you go. Oh. Uh, morning. I kind of wish different inns for their different specialties did different things. <laughs> Got some knots back here. Soon you'll feel fresh as coastal breeze. It's always just three extra hearts and another whole stamina reel. There I go, I can't see you shake off the Gerudo language. I'm meant to say rise and shine. No matter what time it is, that's the best thing to hear when you wake up. Yeah, how much rock salt do I even have? 433, yeah. <laughs> that makes sense. Okay, what are you looking at? I guess it's saying. What, what are you looking at? Hey, it's the guy who fixed our house. Out of the parts, tore down our house. We had to go live in a tent. It's actually kind of fun, but having a I'm like having a secret base. But I'm way happier now that we're back home. You know, Mister, everyone's calling you the savior of our village. Thanks for putting everything back how it used to be. Aww. Sorry, Mister, can't play right now. Got to find my dad's blue shirt. <gasps> the lobster shirt. Aww. It's Dad's favorite thing. He loved it so much he put in iron chest so nobody take it. But I checked everyone, I couldn't find the chest. I think the pirates sank it, so it's probably in the bay since it's too heavy to float away. Oh. Dad's pretending like he doesn't mind, but I bet he's really sad it's gone. Gotta get it back. Or it could be the shirt you have. I assume it's it's the lobster shirt. Cause I haven't found that yet. And and here makes a lot of sense for it, to be honest. Uh so these are just your houses. Welcome to Azor Bay, the village's premier and only restaurant. When you use the f okay. 
We met at Skyview Tower. I knew you were different from the other travelers. Lurlin owes you and Bolson a lot for fixing our houses, rebuilding our shops, and restoring our community. <laughs> anyway, the feast we had was a delight. Seeing Bolson and my boys dance together really tickled me. <laughs> Even remember it now, I can't help but chuckle. You hungry by any chance, or maybe you'd like a meal for the road? Uh. Try to surprise my customers with meals they've never had before. Please. Please do that. That would be so good. <laughs> if this is how I fill out my meal list, that would be fine. A lot of new recipes during my travels. I want to share them with adventurous eaters in Lurlin. Okay. I have never seen that one before. It says new, so. So do come again. So I have to sort out for the day. I see. That's fine. If I come back, I'll try to come back often. Hello. I was just nodding off. Do you need something? It's pretty late. Ah, oh, this is an inn, but the inn is... Yeah, I know. I guess later sometimes. Two growing boys, so you can so we can barely fit in the house ourselves. If you need a place to stay, require it at the end. Okay. Where is it? Well, let's just grab the lot the sh the shirt. I think it's one of those two chests I've been eyeing for a little bit. Hello. Thought you'd be looking tough tougher looking. You look pretty strong beneath the surface. Did I tell you before in Hateno Village that my wife is from here? She's been feeling awful ever since those pirates attacked. Oh. But if you send the pack and we decided it was time to move. Because I start learning the ins and outs of the Lurlin dialect. Razor claw. I think I need that. And if I do need it, that makes sense. What are you guys doing over there? Okay, they're doing something over there. Possibly expanding the village. So, okay, there's a couple chests. There's one over there, there's one right here. There's one out there, even. They're all, they all look like they're metal chests as well. Blue rupee. Okay, attach. No, I, I just need this one. Uh, yeah, just, just this. Okay, what's in this one? Another blue ruby, so it's the one farther out then. Oh, it's quite a bit out, ways out. I, this might be far enough, but m probably not at the same time. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we have more. Okay. This this makes more. This will be easier over here. Push this down as far as possible. And swim to it. Are we... Oh. Oop. There we go. Whew. Barely grabbed it from this angle. This should be it. Ah, there we go. Heat resistance. Did it have re heat resistance in Breath of the Wild? I don't remember. Hmm. Well, while we're here. Heat resistance is a little silly. It should be, like, swim speed. Where's that iron chest with Jad's blue shirt? It's heavy, so it sank. Yeah. Gotta get it back. Wait a minute. <laughs> that blue shirt smells like my dad. That's my dad's shirt. Where do you find it, mister? Can you take it off, please? My dad needs it back. Okay. Hey, yeah, hey, you took off my dad's blue shirt. Dad loved that shirt. He'd be glad to have it back. Here you go. Thank you, mister. I gotta go tell my dad. He was gonna get it right back. Dad. This guy found your shirt, dad. It smells like you, hee <laughs> hee. So that's what you two were doing at, on the beach all day, looking for this. Thought you were out playing. Gosh, thanks for finding us, guys. Oh. You, saving villagers, finding lost items. What can't you do? My trusty blue shirt. When I was a young man, I used to wear it all the time. But I haven't put it on since the boy's mom started picking out my clothes. <laughs> Seems a shame to keep this beauty in a moldy old chest, though. Say, would you want it? 
It would've been funny if it upgraded its defense by doing this. What? But dad, weren't you sad about your shirt? Well, yeah. The one I'm wearing. I was eating soup and I got a big stain on it. I thought it was ruined. But then mommy got rid of the stain, so it's good as new. Oh, so all this time we were worried about the wrong shirt. What? Wrong shirt, wrong shirt. <laughs> Afraid so, kiddo. I'm glad, grateful you did all this for your old man. All that for the old man. Honestly, I can't believe how fast you two are growing up. To make your dad proud, you know that? Very, very proud. Well, that was a fun quest. Very silly. Let's put it back on. I mean, especially while we're here. Ooh, hello. And you, I heard what you did. Helping Bolson rebuild the village? That's amazing, truly. When I heard everyone talk about a hero saving the village, I thought it might have been you. Thank you so much. I know my father, Relzo, is grateful too. When we heard those monsters occupying the village were driven out, we decided to come and look for it round for ourselves. Overall, I'd say it's looking mostly as it did before. I was born and raised here, so I really appreciate all you've done for this village. Now I'd like to do my part to help get things going again in Lurlin Village. Problem is, I'm so hungry I can't think of any think of ideas. Only food, like one meal that I ate long ago. Hylian rice cooked with Goron spice and porgy. Okay. Rice, spice, porgy. A few forkfuls of that, so I'd have the brain power her to come up with an idea for living at loving up the village. Okay. No? Yeah, I'll do an Armand Porgy, sure. Uh, spice and rice. And toxicating smell. Is that? Yep, seafood curry. Ah, uh, this smell. This is the dish I've been dreaming of. You made it for me? Thank you so much. And now, I eat. Oh, that spicy flavor, balanced by a strong note of umami. It's just too delicious. Ah, so satisfying. At last, I can start thinking of ways to draw in visitors. Let's see. Wait, oh no. Hot, hot. The gore and spice is burning me up. I can't focus when my whole body's on fire. What do I do? I need a gust of wind to cool me down. Gust of wind, you say? Uh, well, I don't have... What's uh, his name? Tulin. But I do have this. Ah, uh, much better. I'm glad I just had that on hand. <laughs> now I'm nice and cool. Wait a sec. I, I got an idea. A flag. We can make a flag as a symbol for the village. That'll help draw in visitors and liven up the community. Time to start working on the design. Okay, okay. This here, that there, piece of cake. Ooh, it's a little fish. Head on, which is a little strange, but that's fine. Satisfactory job, if I do say so myself. Thanks. Really, I couldn't have dreamed up such a great idea without your help. Now I think I'll go liven up Lurland Village with a new flag. Here, it's the fabric I used for the flag. Ooh. Ooh, fancy. <laughs> if you go to Tino Village's dye shop, they can probably help with that. Yep. Should I do that now? No. Uh, let's unclick that. <laughs> let's go back to the app, Tree Axe. Uh, we've already looked at your... That's an interesting one. We'll have to go there soon. You, people, what are you doing over here? Oh, no. What, what are you guys doing now? Uh -huh. Hey now, what's on your mind? You're thinking about teaming up with your pal Bolson again, aren't you? I'm not surprised. Our chemistry is out of this world, yeah? Funny thing is, I was just talking to the mayor about creating some kind of new traction in Lurlin. Mm. Yes, I'd like it to be some kind of entertainment. Something everyone could really get behind and enjoy. Mm. You've traveled all over the place, haven't you? Any marvelous idea of yours? Open a floating hotel? Offer underwater tours? Host a water rally? Huh? Underwater? We can't go underwater in this game, so I know this is not gonna- I like it, sounds dreamy. Yes, but breathing would be a problem. <laughs> uh, floating hotel, we already have a thing, so maybe not. How romantic. Already have an inn, yeah, exactly. 
uh, water rally? <laughs> on race, rally race on the water? Clever, very clever, don't you think? Oh. Hmm, well, it would be a brand new form of water-related amusement. <laughs> that could be do the trick? Yes, in fact, I think that's it. Oh. I seem to recall Hudson saying something about inviting some hot shot professional racers to help develop some new vehicles. If we could work with them. Hudson, you mean that fellow from that Terrytown place in Northeast Akala? I'd love to invite the racers here once they finish their work there. Though I do wonder if real professional racers will become willing to come to a place like this. Oh, we haven't done that quest in forever. Like, I don't even... <laughs> like, we, we, we made one vehicle and that was it? Oh boy, that's something interesting to think about. Uh, I think there's uh, one more quest there for us. Yeah. Uh, without that boat, I guess I'm just stuck. Oh, you're Link. Well, here you are, our hero. I returned to my village when I heard the pirates disappeared. Who do you... Th who'd think I'd bump into you here? Well, unfortunately, I don't really have time to chat. The thing is, my boat's gone. With it, how I get my trading done, uh, I don't know where it's gone to. All boats in the village are gone, too. I can't even find a replacement for it. I washed out to sea. Things that float away from our village often wash up on Tonoka, an island off the eastern coast. Tonoko. Uh, there's found ways to see I don't have a boat to get a boat. Seems like I'm stuck. I'll never be able to reopen my shop. I saw some things you can o you can find only here, and my customers are eager to see me to get my shop up and running again. Okay. Tonoko? I've been there. Oh. Okay. We're gonna have to just travel with a boat of our own. That's not too bad. Where are you going? Hello? Oh, you gotta fix our house. The savior guy. Um, thank you. You think pretty good, huh? Oh, yeah, Skyview Tower. Hey, play with me. Play, um, quiz. Sure. <laughs> really good at cooking, so I know lots about ingredients and stuff. Aww. Quiz time. High-tail lizards and hot-footed frogs can both go into elixirs to make you run faster. Which one has a bigger effect? The lizard. <laughs> no? Okay. That's why they're so hard to catch, Whoa. huh? There are lots of frogs near ponds and waterfalls. I have way more of the frogs than lizards, so <laughs> that was my reasoning. Tell these frogs don't come out anymore. Even when it rains. Uh, I got scared by the pirates and are hiding in caves. Oh. Uh, sure. Oh, hey, Stone Talus. Uh, I see. Okay, Battle Talus. Ouch. There we go. And up. And Talus Killer. Oh. Okay. That's a lot more damage than I expected. Holy. Whew. The reason I made this specifically for Talus is. Whoo! And why I don't want to use it on just mining. Uh-huh. Because how much extra damage does... 27. I don't have a rare one on me to see how much the rare ones do. Uh, I guess I'll attach this to a... Do I have something with durability up? <laughs> no? Okay, just, just, just put it on uh, this weapon, sure. So that's 13. Nah, eh, not that bad. Good. Okay, what's in the chest? Mostly came in here because there was a little alcove area, and I wondered if there'd be a cave. No cave. That's fine. Ooh, opals. Good. I need to pick up more opals. Because I'm out. Like, very out. Oh, rubies. I keep forgetting. Uh, well, next time I need to fight something, 
I'm gonna try throwing the staff. I don't know what'll happen. If he'll just act like a, a staff and shoot shoot projectiles, or if it'll be thrown and act like the gem would. Hello! I see you. Ooh, ooh, we have fan, fun things to work with here. Oh my gosh, you're on the edge of the cliff. Well, we have fun things. Uh, and honestly, very, very simple. We just... Catch like that, and we're good. Surely. I really just drop that. Okay, hold it like this. And press it up against, and... Uh, it's probably good. Oh, it's you. Thanks. Wait, it's connected to it, too. Uh, I don't know how that's going to work. Putting present Hudson here, too. Can't stand here forever. Got so many more signs to spread around. What? Are you going to support him? All right, I'll let go. Okay, I don't think it's actually connected to the wood. How's the president standing? That was brilliant. I never thought of it. Alright, let's get him secured while he's still standing. I guess I could have attached to the rock and to the wood, and it would have connected that way. I'm not actually sure. I should test that. Perfect. With your help, President Hudson is now standing proudly and firmly in place. It fills my heart with joy to see him doing so well on his own. Thank this my thanks. Also, you must be hungry after all the hard work. Uh, so I still don't think I'll thank you enough. He stole something from premium collection. Ah. Now I can go to other places and put more signs. With that, I'm off. Uh, I need to test this. Very important. Uh, this will do. Can I... Oh, I can't... Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna do this somewhat differently, then. I need another object. Do we not have any more objects around here? We have objects down there, and honestly, it's both objects. So let's, let's try this down there. Oh, it doesn't go into other objects. Only, only the ground. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to test that then. Oh hi. Uh, that's fine. Okay, quick and dirty boat. We're off. And honestly, there might be something on this little bit of shore. Can I take out that monster from here? I don't think so. Oh yeah, there's something back there. I forgot about that. <laughs> Alright, the 2 a.m. boat, or like for 200 rupees or whatever thing. Hey, look, some boats. We're here. Is that something in the water out there? It really looks like it. That log is glowing. What? That's yeah, definitely glowing. Uh, can I reverse it again? Saves me some time. Makes it a bit easier to reach. There's some ruins on the island behind it as well. Why did I do that? Why is there... Why? 
It has it on two different sides as well. Three different sides. What? Okay, well... Oh, no. Oh, no. I, I know what these runes are. Uh, couldn't tell from that distance. Oh, and there's more things floating around. What the heck? Wait, is this what I think it is? No, it's not. There's a chest in it, though. I thought these were... This was a, a shrine thing. It looked kind of like it from certain angles. Okay, what's with the... What? Oh, you know what? These are messages in a bottle. Where are they coming from? Someone's someone stuck somewhere. They're they're sending out messages. Right? That's what it is. They're coming from this island. I think. Maybe. That's another. What are they coming? Where are they coming from? Like, there's something around here. That's a whole on box. And is there there's something else? There, I think. Something's sending a message. There's just seeds. What? What am I find? What is this? I'm just gonna follow this all the way. I don't know where this is going. Ooh, that's coming from somewhere over there. It's going backwards. What? Something over there. And they're coming from over there, I think. No, I missed. Uh. Ah. Here it is, this cave. Ooh, there's a cork. Uh, I'll free the cork. Can I free it that way? That would have been fun. Oh, I'll just attach the boat to it. Go. Let's pull it out. Yeah. Yeah. No? Not good enough? Okay, there it goes. Go. The only real way I know how to do that. Alright, cave time. Oh, I should have turned the boat around. Whatever. Okay. So this is where all of the things are coming from. Which has a boat and everything. And a path that's kind of blocked off, but that's where everything's coming from. Okay. So, nothing's coming out anymore. A little strange. But we're here now, so I guess the game doesn't technically need it. Hello, person. Don't mind me. Oh, are you stuck? No, you're stuck here because, like, your boat is... Like, completely stranded or something. Who are you? You know what? I don't care. If you're here, then I'm saved. Ugh, I've been stuck in here for ages. Did you find my message in a bottle and come to rescue me? Oh, you didn't even see my message. No, of course you didn't. Mm. My hopes and dreams in that bottle, but I guess they all sunk. First, there's attack on Lurland Village, which meant I couldn't restock my supply of fish. Then I go up to fish my own, but the only thing I catch is a storm. So I go take shelter in this cave, and boom, I'm stuck. Aww. Now you tell me that my letter, my one shot of getting out here, never found its reader, just one thing after another. I never found a letter. I followed all of the things coming out of the cave. Huh? Mm -hmm. Wait, hold on. Whole point of the letter was to get someone to come help me. Here's someone. You can help me. 
You know, luck's finally turning around. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it has to be. That's gotta be. That's gotta bode well for business. Oh. Yeah, it's for you. Picked it up off the ground here in the cave. Sounds better in my head. It's a nice reward, honest. I was planning to t take it home with me once I got out. Ooh. Uh -huh. Really? Oh yeah. A little rewards, the least I can do. Mm. All right, I'm out of here. If our paths ever do cross again, you should buy me some buy some mm -hmm. fish off me. Living time to pay pillar, huh? Things gonna have been so long. Bottled cry for help. Moving the rock. Okay, I don't. I never found a bottle. <laughs> I found all the things floating out of the cave. Like really? Uh oh, there you are. I was wondering where you went. Uh, oh, there's just a whole another upper ledge. Didn't even notice this. Where are you? You're over here. I'll take this. Nice. All right. Anything else up here that I care about? Not really. Okay, time to head to actual destination. I can't believe he actually there was something other than the little lights. Uh, I'm probably not the only person who found him from the lights, and not a bottle that is somewhere out in the world that might not even be there anymore now that I rescued him. So I might not ever find. Great. Oh, that didn't even do that much damage. Running over you does a decent amount though. Oh, he takes forever to come back in the water. Oh, it's dead. No, it's not, whatever. You know, I follow the direction of all those lights. I could probably... I say that when there's a clear, like, ocean current. If I follow this ocean current, I should find where his, his message would have landed. I can barely see this current, but it's... it's I'm also going crazy. It is going this way. Sort of landed over here. I swear I've been over here at some point. There's lots of stuff washed ashore here. That's for sure. Yeah, I came down on this. Or I came to get this. Yeah, so I've definitely been here. And because there's a cave over there somewhere. Never went to go see it. I don't see a bottle. It might be gone. It might be too late. Uh, a little disappointing. I'll at least take another uh, bit of power. Go much faster this way. Let's see, is there anything up here? Since I made it all the way over here anyways. There's a Korok. Wait. Hi. Okay, I saw you already at some point. Does that mean there's no fun chest full of rupees? No? Wait, okay. I don't remember coming over here, but... <laughs> I guess I must have. Yeah, there, there was a, uh, it was Cass, right, from Breath of the Wild, the musician. He had like a quest, something about specific time of the day. Look at the shadow of that obelisk thing with the pillar, uh, and there's a chest there, full of money. Yay! You solved his ancient song. Whatever it was. Very much miss him in this game. Don't know what happened to him. He's just gone. Haven't seen him again since. Or I seen him at all. Okay, I wonder. Do I actually take one of the, these or just attach it? I'll take it. Oh, there's a... Yeah, I see the cave. We've already been in that cave. 
We had to whistle to get in. This will be an interesting one to cash stuff to. Uh, that's the... Wait, which way's the front? I think this is the back. Or at least that's how I'm going to treat it. And considering it's a tail fin, that makes sense. Oh, it's supposed to be a whale! That's very Zelda. There's been possibly two very important uh, whales in Zelda. Very important. Uh, po I say possibly two because it might be the same one, technically. Uh, <laughs> uh, and might not be considered whales, who knows. I should have put those closer to the center so I could turn better. Well, this drifts a lot. Oh well. We're off. I have to go all the way around. This will take a minute. Oh. This counts as Lurland Village? I guess because of the race that's going to be out here at some point? I guess I, that kind of makes sense. Oh, could you imagine doing this, like, in Breath of the Wild with a sail? And a leaf? <laughs> Would take it forever. Oh, they had they had stuff here for me to have put together as well. Didn't even bother. Why are there horses out in that area? Whatever. Inefficient horses. Like nowhere they can really go other than through the t town. Oh, I needed to. Dang it. I needed to get it to... Hit. Well, I guess I could just grab it. I don't need to go... I don't need to sail around. Pick it up. Oh, that was... I just need to get closer. Ah, is that a boat? Hey, over here, and bring that boat. You found a boat for me? Thank you so much. Such generosity demands swift action. So, if you'll just excuse me for a bit. He's gonna go fishing. Oh, I need this part, and that goes there, I think. Get out of the way, and yeah, no, maybe, yes, it's done. Ooh! Mm. Oh, that looks so cool! Ta da! What do you think? I'm gonna call this fine vessel, vessel the Ever Lovely Mubs. Something about giving it a name really makes it more important to me. Here, take this. It's the least I can do after you help me reopen my stock. My store. Oh, that's nice. It's a very rare thing you can't find anywhere. Don't sell star fragments either, but my shop does try to stock rarer things you can't find elsewhere if I can. Take pride in my goods, so please come back to my shop whenever you like. Where? Oh, what's over here? Porgy crabs. Uh, I've got a fish caught this morning, so flapping their fishers. Yeah. Wait, it's free? Ooh, I want all of this. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Overstock, don't stay away too long. Octorok, yes, yes. I hope it's random what he has. Uh, is there an easy way? He said don't go far or something. Let me, let me, uh, take, spend the... Spend the night? Dang it, the campfire doesn't work. Oh, no, it did say sit for a second. There we go. Ooh, wait a second. This is back. It was like five rupees last time, but... Yeah. Huh. Is there more stock? It doesn't look like it. But that's usually, from what I've experienced, because I need to reload the area. Well, it looks like the same stuff. I mean, I'll take the crabs and the eyeball because those are important. But I won't steal the rest of your stuff because I have plenty and enough. Uh, these are interesting way to uh, float. In Breath of the Wild, you could, you could 
could use those to get to the to get as high as you wanted, really. All the way to the sky. And with the Frawley's Gale, you can send them up a little bit faster. Uh, so I think that's everything we can do here until I go back and do some races. I forgot about that. There's so much in like every town left for me to do. Oh, I should probably spend some time doing just that. We'll see though, I might get sidetracked.